just really appreciate you taking time to share some of the things I have to say. I just, wait, does that make sense? Um, I read a lot of different things. Um, mostly what I would say I enjoy, I enjoy modern classics. I enjoy classics. Um, I enjoy some YA, um, though I'm becoming pickier with what I find I enjoy. I, I like YA fantasy simply because I don't like, like, super in-depth fantasy usually. I just like having a little bit of, like, um, magic and a little bit of whimsy. So I like, um, some middle grade as well for those same reasons. And I like portal fantasy. So I love, um, Alice in Wonderland is another one of my favorite classics. Um, and so I like middle grade and YA that kind of plays off that, like, feeling of, of magic and that feeling of the unknown, like as a child that things just seemed, um, kind of un amazing, but unknown. Like you, you know, you would have these, these visions of like, you know, castles and happy ever afters and, and magic and wands and fairy godmothers or whatever it was that you liked as a kid. And I like books that kind of, um, remind you of that or reinvigorate it. Um, and I've been recently reading some thrillers though to me, and I haven't read that many, so I can't really say, but to me, a lot of thrillers are not going to be that like five star read for me. Um, I found maybe one or two, I know one, um, and some mysteries I enjoy, but I like more of like a modern classic mystery, like, um, Elizabeth Sanze Holding is someone I really enjoy. Um, and I read, um, Agatha Christie recently and I, I liked that. Um, but yeah, I, I like when the gothic and the mystery kind of cross. Um, I enjoy that. And I do enjoy some um, contemporary. Um, yeah, so I'm kind of all over the place. Really what I'm looking for are good books. Um, maybe one day I'll do a video talking about buzzwords that I like. I know that's kind of like a thing on YouTube. People talk about the buzzwords. Um, and I definitely have some. I also have some tropes that I really enjoy. Um, recently, if you know any books that do this, please let me know. Recently, I've realized that I love the trope where there's a young woman, because I like coming of age stories. And um, yeah, so there's a young woman and her family dies or they lose all their money or they lose their home or whatever the situation is. And she has to relocate to a new situation and kind of start over. I love that in books. Um, so yeah, if you know any, uh, Jamaica Inn is one, but yeah, if you know any like that, that's my thing. I think that is like my favorite trope, if it is a trope. I mean, it's like tropey, so yeah, but I don't feel that it's like overdone or anything. I think that it's very classic and I think that it works well in a lot of different situations. So yeah, so um, what else? I hope that everybody is doing well and taking care of themselves. Thanks for being here with me today. Farewell for now. Bye-bye.